Welcome to Patina Bicycle Rescue, where history rides again. Today we have a, a Nishiki. Picked this up mm, about two years ago, maybe a little less, um, in Santa Monica, California, just several blocks from the beach. A uh, bicycle basically had been abandoned by the gentleman's ex-girlfriend. She took off. She left the bike behind. It was sitting in a open-air garage parking deck. Uh, so the salt air is really taking its effect on this. When I purchased the bicycle from him, I had high hopes of turning this into something just totally amazing. I was very enthusiastic. Uh, here we are all these this time later, and obviously not so enthusiastic. But what I do have and what I do realize after... Uh, rehabbing many, many, many bicycles, is we have an ultimately a very cool rat rod here. I'm not going to turn this into perf perfection. Uh, that would be crazy of me to even think that at this point, considering the, the amounts. You can see the rust there on the, the handlebars and stuff. But what we have and I have learned is we have, again, a rat rod. We will recable this, we will put on new tires, we will put on the new brake pads. This, everything it needs, it will get. And it won't be a pretty bike, but it's going to be an awesome bike. This is gonna be one of those, you can take it anywhere, nobody's gonna steal it, but it's going to ride amazing. And it is also very cool in its vintage form. And it's not to just say, oh, let's part out the bike. We can take this or we could take that from it. No, no, no. We're putting this back on the road because that's what we do here at Patina Bicycle Rescue. So thank you for visiting us. Please watch for our completed video down the road. You can find me on Facebook, uh, Patina Bicycle Rescue. You can find me on YouTube where you're watching these videos. Please subscribe. And please, any positive comments you'd like to email me, Patina period bicycle period rescue at AOL.com.